Intelligent, witty, capable, Ravenclaw. Sponsors of this entertainment commentary. Making a response video to haters is kind of like making a spaghetti bolognese with horse meat. You might think it'll work, but all you actually do is just leave a foul taste in your mouth. And even anime has to have its few share of haters, and it's up to one, or one thousand, person to stand up to these haters. What's up guys, Leatherbelt665 here to talk to you today about anime haters. I know this is a minor nitpick, but why about this entire video do you have to record your desktop? You could have simply have just taken an image out of Google. Now, I'm not gonna write this out, I'm just gonna speak this through my mind, you know? But, um, first of all, anime haters, we really don't care about your opinions. We really don't care about your opinions, which is why I'm making this video stating how we really don't care about your opinions. Which means in some way, I've had to have cared about your opinions to have made this video. If you have something to, like, say, you can say it to us, but we won't care. We're not like bronies or anything where we don't take it seriously. Some of us might be taking it seriously, but, um, not all of us. So you state that you're not like the brony fandom in taking things seriously, but then some anime fans do take things seriously, but not all of you. Fun fact, that's exactly like the brony fandom. What else? Um, I... I just don't really understand why people hate it. I mean, it's like, I know it's kind of weird because of the breasts and the perverted jokes and all this kind of crap, but, well, I don't really know about the perverted jokes, but I know there are some things that are perverted and stuff, but, um... Oh yeah, it's not like a person hates the anime because of the story or the characters or the animation. No, it's just because of the idea that it's always perverted. It seems that you're only looking for the stereotypical ideology of an anime hater, which has already been talked about before, so I have to question what new things are you going to bring to the table. You know, all that stuff is, wasn't meant for children. I mean, some people are like, oh, well, anime is like for children, isn't it? No, it's for, like, some animes are, while, like, most are for, like, teenagers and adults and stuff. So... Honestly, you just, you guys don't really have to be so mad about it. Like, oh God, it's just this anime hate. I don't really see it much. Yes, I don't see anime hate that much, but considering I love anime, I feel the need to have to make this video, even though I'm just repeating what everyone else has said before. I mean, I was just arguing with a brony on the internet, and he had the, he's like, because I have a picture of something anime, okay? And he's like, get that anime fag, anime, or whatever, like, anti fag picture out of here. And I was like, okay, look, just because you got a brony picture doesn't mean that you got to bring in my picture about it. I have to ask, what has the brony fandom got to do with anything? The only thing I'm getting at is that you're trying to compare the anime fandom to the brony fandom to make the anime fandom look superior. Which, when you think about it, both fandoms have the amount of sane and rabid fans. Personally, I think anime is really f entertaining. I think it's one that, like, Japan is known to have one of the best entertainments in the world. And that, like, anime is one of the main reasons. I have no idea what the hell you're trying to say. Are you trying to say that anime is not the main reason that Japan has the best entertainment, or are you saying that anime is the main reason Japan has the best entertainment? The way you structure that sentence is so confusing. But in the case of you actually saying that it is the reason, then you're only looking at a part of the Japanese entertainment. Yes, anime is very popular in Western countries, but Disney is also popular in Japan, which is, of course, American. In hindsight, we'd have to look even further into what type of entertainment is the most popular, considering that different cultured entertainment is distributed around different places around the world. So honestly, I think for all those anime haters out there, um, you guys really need to research about how successful anime has gotten. And I would love to see you explain how this is relevant. It doesn't matter how popular something is, it's not going to change someone's opinion over it. You know what else is also popular at this time? 
My Little Pony Friendship is Magic. For entertainment and stuff. Sure, I like old American cartoons like Ed, Ed, and Eddie and all them, but, um... You know, those are good American cartoons, but now they cancel them. I mean, I've... I've... It's hard to explain, but... I Since I was, like, maybe three or four, I've watched anime. This is irrelevant. This has got nothing to do with the argument about anime haters. This is just your life story, so I'm gonna skip it. So, I don't care what people have to say about, like, anime. Yeah, you clearly showed that by making a five-minute video about anime haters. It's just entertainment, guys. It's not, like... Yeah. You know, you easily could have gone into Windows Movie Maker and just edit those out. Yeah. You get it. I just, I find it sad how people have to criticize it for these common things like hentai and stuff. Like, not all of us are all about hentai. Look, I know what hentai looks like and it creeps me out sometimes. Actually, all the time. But, I mean, the artwork and stuff for, like, some forms are really good. But, you guys don't really need to criticize it, like, some shows, like Full Metal Alchemist, because I my, my name on uh, Steam is Full Metal Kusanagi. Great work, you've gone off topic again. Also skipping. But, um, I just don't get why people have to criticize you know, anime and stuff. Maybe it's that new fangled thing that kids are all having. It's called different taste. That's all I gotta say about this subject because everybody has, everybody has to hate anime for their reasons, and I don't really mind it, but they need a good reason to hate it. And there's your video right there. If you just said that, then you wouldn't have made yourself look like an idiot. Like the breast thing. Is a good one, but you have to get more in detail with it. But anyways, yeah, that's all I have to say. So, um, this is other about six six five. See you later, guys. If you like something, say a TV show or a movie or an anime, why do you have to worry about what other people say about it? Just continue enjoying that certain thing because of the reasons that you like it. With that being said, this is entertainment.